when you're going out there to play polo. It's intense. It's going 30, 40 miles an hour, getting the horses crashing and battling, and the guys basically going out to war. It's a feeling like nothing else I've experienced. Polo is at a moment where things are going to have a drastic change. It's either going to enter into a new realm, being on par with other professional sports, or it's going to be a historic sport that doesn't exist anymore. We saw problems with umpiring, and we saw problems with how the game was being filmed, and we wanted to try and solve them. We thought that a drone would be the perfect solution. Polo right now, it's becoming overly technical and teams are winning on penalty shots. And I think for the spectator, it's been a tough game to get into because of that fact. Once we started using Inspire One, it changed the game. We were able to live stream with HD signal, provide instant replay, provide teams with strategy film, social media posts. It was kind of our all-in-one tool that we could use for everything. To ensure safety, all the players are aware of the drone. They have helmets on. We don't fly over any spectators or anything that's not in our control. There is so many things to improve as a professional game. The good thing about the stage of polo right now is that everybody's trying to listen more than before. We meet with Adolfo Cambiasso and Facundo Pires, two best players in the world right now, and we talk about how to make polo better. And one of the biggest uses of the drone is that when they have a complaint or a suggestion, we can use this footage to help the players and the umpire get on the same page. Having the view from up top actually allows the umpires to get a higher percentage of correct calls. Prior to using the drone, we had to use the videos just from the side camera. So you didn't get to see how a play unfolded. When we have our instant replay official, he can see the whole field where you can really honestly say if it was a good call or not. Okay, Red loses the challenge the polo field is so big imagine 10 football fields in one polo field so because of the immensity drone technology has totally changed our ability to see what's going on throughout the entire field so the viewer has a much better opportunity to see and understand polo in a way that they've never been able to before I think the drones are giving a new perspective to see the place, to understand the lines, to understand the rules. It's a way to understand tactics and we can see what the other team is doing. But we base all of our filmmaking around showing what it's like to play polo, to make people fall in love with the sport. And I think that what we're doing with DJI's help is to change it into something for the better.